Your vehicle may be equipped with a variety of features to make your drive more comfortable and more enjoyable. Driver's seat controls are generally on the outboard side and may include front, back, height and tilt adjustments, as well as lumbar support and adjustable armrests. Heated seats can be turned on or off, either with a button on the seat or in the center stack. The driver's door has controls for your windows, locks, and side mirror positions. If your vehicle is equipped with driver memory profiles, those buttons can be found here too. Headlights, fog lights, pickup bed lights, and more can be controlled with the headlight control switch on the dashboard or the multi-function lever on the steering column where you can also operate high beams and turn signals. Your steering column is also where you'll find the wiper washer lever, as well as controls for adjustable pedals and the steering column itself. And your steering wheel not only provides controls for the audio system and instrument cluster display, but also access to voice recognition for your phone or radio and certain safety and convenience features like adaptive cruise control. The overhead console is generally where you'll find controls for map lights, lift gate, sunroof, and sunshade. If equipped with the Homelink programmable garage door opener, you'll find that here as well, or on your sun visor. Some vehicles come with the option to change the electronic power steering mode through the Uconnect system. To customize the effort needed to steer, go to Settings, then Safety and Driving Assistance, and select Normal, Sport, or comfort. On four-wheel drive vehicles, the transfer case controls are on the instrument panel, center console, or floor. And of course, the gear selector is always centrally located and easily accessible. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.